Well, Oklahoma is home to students literally from around the world. That's why each year Oklahoma's Farm Bureau sponsors a trip around our state for international students. Sam Knipp takes us along. As the auctioneers chant echoed across the sale ring in Bristol, Oklahoma, 56 international students representing 23 countries got a taste of rural Oklahoma. This was the 8th annual Oklahoma State University International Student Tour, sponsored by Farm Bureau's Young Farmers and Ranchers. Hope Fieschi, a young farmer from Goltry, Oklahoma, coordinated the tour. I want them to go home and say, I had this really neat experience. I went out, I saw what happened, what happens on Oklahoma farms. I learned how they produce our food, and I learned that they are responsible in the way that they do things, and that they um, really have a good lifestyle and that they produce high quality products and um, it was a really good experience for me. Some of the stops included on the two-day tour a livestock sale barn, winery, feed mill, cattle ranch and a dairy. Mercedes Barta owns the Barta Dairy near Perkins. It's, it's good to have people come out and see what goes on. Brenda Dean, coordinator of international student programs at Oklahoma State University, said the tour is a must-have experience. I think it's a very important for many Oklahomans who don't have the opportunity to travel or experience things beyond our own borders. Uh, it's very important that we have these international students here to, to share with us uh, the riches of the rest of the world. And uh, truly the exchange of ideas is, is what's going to help us all grow uh, and improve our lives. And what did the students think? For Pauline Odd, a doctoral student in animal reproductive physiology from Lebanon, this tour was an act of diplomacy. It's, it's a real experience to get to know the, the, the land, you know, get to know the operations and also get to know the people and interact with them. So it's really very nice diplomacy and actually you get to introduce a little bit of your country too. So, I mean, it's a win-win situation, I guess. Who would have guessed that world diplomacy could be found in rural Oklahoma?